Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with another movie and this is Demon Slayer uh, Mugen Resha Hen. And I was waiting. Like I'm sure like everyone was waiting for this movie. And it's finally here. And I kind of said in the previous week uh, that I'll do this movie if this comes out. And thankfully it came out today. Uh, not today but tomorrow I, I think. Uh, so like yeah, I'll just react to this uh, as soon as possible. You know and i'm quite excited because like you know demon slayer has an amazing story and the animation group or the <laughs> it's ufo table and it, like you know like they make like ufo table makes anime so well so imagine the amount of what can i say like like the the amount of the level of animation in the movie the movies have a huge budget so this will be amazing like the fate uh, like you know the fate stay night uh, like i watched it in the previous uh, week uh, the heaven's field movie and that was like so like the animation was so damn good and like demon slayer the movie uh, is came out recently you know a few uh, six or seven months ago i think so yeah I'm looking forward to the animation and the story as well because uh, like th this movie is canon as far as I know like this is just after what happens in the anime so like it's not like the other movies you know which are like not canon and stuff but anyways so yeah if you're new to my channel uh, I'm sure a few people will be new to my channel uh, because like I've never like you know like this is like I'm reacting first time to the Demon Slayer franchise so welcome to my channel and uh, like I should tell you guys like I usually do timer reactions and because of copyright and stuff and obviously like this is a movie this will definitely be a timer reaction it's like two hours long so yeah that's just something that I wanted you guys to know so yeah without further ado let's get started with this movie this is Demon Slayer uh, Mugen Reshahen so I'll be putting the subtitles and the timer here. Sync it to whichever is your preference and let's get started with this movie. All right, so here's a countdown. Three, two, one, go. All right. Ah. Oh man, this is gonna be good. <laughs> All right. Excuse me. Okay. Your foot table. Genji Hideki, you know. What? Are these graves? Damn. Oh, this is the leader of the Hashiras. Who is this lady? Have we seen her before? Oh, it's one of those uh, girls, uh, those two girls. Oh, damn, like so many. I'm guessing these are all like demon slayers who have died. Yeah. <laughs> Seven cases. This girl, she looks a lot older than we saw her before. What am I? Okay.
your for table production okay I've forgotten most of the names of the especially the Hashiras you know I only remember Rengoku and like obviously we know Shinobu like we have already met her but all the other Hashiras I do not remember the name Rengoku was easy enough for me to remember because I think Rengoku means purgator, purgator isn't doesn't it yeah Tengoku is heaven Jigoku is hell and Rengoku is purgatory Damn. Okay, we are continuing from this scene. <laughs> Lord of Sand. Run Zenitsu. <laughs> jump Zenitsu, jump. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, that uh, one, of, one of those enemies is on top of the train, isn't he? <laughs> Everyone's like, who is this guy? Like naked and with a like boar mask, like what? Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> oh, said. <laughs> Wow, so is this going to be on train like this whole thing? Is this called Mugen Resha Hen? That is Mugen uh, like train. Mugen train, yeah. So is will this movie be on train? Like that'll be quite cool, you know. Whoa. <laughs> oh damn, he's eating. Whoa. Ha! What? He's commenting on each and every dish. Oh no, in each and every bite. Damn. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> no. Ha! <laughs> Whoa! Oh damn, he ate so many of them. Oh, what the? <laughs> yeah, Nezuko. Okay. Oh, Hinosuke! Don't break the glass! <laughs> hmm. Okay. One more thing. Oh, he needs training because of his flame thing. Oh, okay. I got his father as well. Hmm. 
Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. Suguko, my apprentice. <laughs> Oh. Okay. So what about the other oh, offshoots? For example, uh, Inos case, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunate. Oh. Oh, damn. So that's why he can use both water and fire breathing, isn't it? <laughs> okay. Hmm. Damn, no scare. <laughs> what is it doing? Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, true. Well, yes. Yeah, like, like, wasn't that the mission? Like, stop. Oh my god. Bad luck, then, so. <laughs> I'm getting off. Oh my god, who is this? Oh my god, this guy looks suspicious. Yeah, he looks suspicious. Oh, great. The demon or something? Tokyo to Mugen. So, oh, Mugen is like a name of a place. Oh no, this guy looks suspicious. Um Oh god. Oh no. Oh. Oh he yeah, this this guy looks suspicious. Oh. Oh my god. Oh, what the hell? Damn, this guy's tall! Oh, or, or this demon is tall.
Damn. Whoa, what's happening? Damn! Yo! The animation! <laughs> Annoying fire! Wow, this is barely the start. Yeah, it's amazing. Oh, there's one more. <laughs> oh boy yeah run like you know oh I'm um, run away like Zen's just like Inosuke Yeah Oh damn this guy can Whoa Whoa Damn, this is... Oh, this is amazing! Yeah, this is... Yeah, isn't it? The whole... Taking out of your... Okay, no, no. This is not EI. I was thinking he was do, going to do the... Wow! Oh, no, this... Okay. There it is. Whoa, Rengoku is OP. He just killed two demons with two... in two moves. <laughs> Bro? <laughs> What's with this way of talking? <laughs> Damn, Inosuke is also converted. Okay. Oh no, what now? Okay, nothing else. <laughs> In this case, on, on Zen's lap. Okay, what now? Oh, what the? So, so they're sleeping because of him? Oh, great, this guy is here. I don't Oh, wow. Oh. Oh. Who is this? What is this? It's. Oh, damn. So he's using them to kind of... Yeah, capture them. 
और अतः रियली स्लीप और Oh, he's dreaming about the times when he saved Nezuko. Oh no, there's something else. Does he know that he's dreaming? Like, oh, wait. Hmm? Okay, like, yeah. Oh, what? Oh. Okay. So th these kids must have like the demon must have something on them, otherwise. Oh, hey. he still has his coat on, you know, the demon slayer. No, please don't say that. Ah, great. Yeah. So this guy uses dreams as his weapon. He cannot like this. We have not seen Nezuko in the dream. I'm sure like that is somehow going to like make him understand that this is not the real world. This is a dream world. 
lower one. Oh, okay, we're probably going to see their dreams as well. Then it's when you know scared. Yeah, there you go. Oh wow! <laughs> then it's uh... Zenitsu also has uh, his coat. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Whoa! Zenitsu! <laughs> Zenitsu is having the time of his life. Let's see what Inosuke is seeing. Must be something related to Tanjiro. I'm sure about it. Or... I don't know, let's see. What? I was not expecting this. Bonjiro! Sparkly acorns. What? <laughs> oh my god. What is Rengoku saying? Oh. Oh, is this his brother or something? Oh, father, okay. Oh, his voice. He's a good voice actor from Fate. Damn, they all look the same. Okay. Tenjuro. Yeah. 
Yes. Damn, his uh, dream is quite sad, even though, like, he said that, like, you know, like, happy dreams. Oh! Why are they also kind of like, is this some kind of... Oh yeah, 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 he has infiltrated. She has infiltrated. Edge of the dream. They're using... Oh. Spiritual core. Oh. Oh my god. So this demon plays dirty. That's basically it. Oh. And he's not even doing it himself, like he's using, making other people do it, like, damn. Oh, damn, this is the subconscious. Wow, it's burning. Yeah. Oh, there is that it? Okay. Oh. Damn. Rengahu, wake up. Yeah. Okay, Tanji is also kind of. What about Nezuko? I forgot. Is she also dreaming? I completely forgot about her. I don't think she's dreaming. She's... Like, I don't think they know that Nezuko is, you know, in the box that Tanjiro's carrying. Oh, damn, he is mistaking that. Dave, as I said, like, I'm sure, like, yeah, lack of Nezuko is going to somehow make him wake up.
There you go. Oh. Oh yeah, she's a demon. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what he. Damn. Like that's why he said like in in the middle of the day. There you go. Or maybe not. Hmm. Oh, what the? Wait, what? Is, is this a subconscious or something? Yeah, 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 yeah. This must be survival instinct. Yeah, yeah. That's a survival instinct or something like that. Tatakae. <laughs> Damn. After AOT, Tatakae seems. Yeah, yeah. Like, slap yourself or something? You know, like pinch yourself as you. <laughs> what about as I was saying? What about Nezuko? Yeah, yeah, she she's awake. There you go. Like they don't know that Nezuko is here. Cut the rope or or something. I don't know. Like you know. <laughs> oh yeah, headbutt him. That that's supposed. To... Oh. <laughs> oh. Damn, Nezuko. How hard did she hit him? Oh yeah, the blood demon art. There you go. Oh my god, let's go. There you go, now he's on full, like, you know, uniform, yeah. Time to go, yeah. How will he even wake up, you know? <clears throat> oh, that boy, he can probably go and capture him, you know? Oh, no. Oh, oh God.
Oh. Wait, what is he doing here? Like Okay, let's see what his subconscious is. Whoa! This is just nothing. Like we saw this in Gives uh like you know that um uh, the technique uh, what was what was the form I forgot the number of the form oh what is this is this like you know, you know it, this must be inno's case i think Yeah, it's in us case. <laughs> yeah, what? Is... <laughs> oh, this must be Zenitsis. Oh no, the, the sleeping Zensu might be here, or, or maybe not. The person who comes out when he sleeps. What the? What? Oh no. <laughs> then this is the most powerful one out of all of them. <laughs> yeah. This guy's chilling up on top. What the hell? Yeah. Oh, is that is that? Yeah.
Wow. What? Oh. Is he going to hurt himself to get out of this dream or something? Yeah. Oh no. Oh god. Okay, he woke up. What's going to happen to the boy in his dream? Like, you know, he's still in the dream, but he has woken up. <laughs> I think it's good. Yeah. <laughs> so he woke up. Yeah. Yeah, cut the rope or, 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 I don't know. Oh. Okay, yeah, the, he said that he used a ticket. Wow. I also think like I, I think it's somehow connected. So you, you can untangle it. Like will that help? Oh, burn off. Not waking. <laughs> oh, what about Rengoku? Oh! Oh yeah, he, she woke up because she, like, Rengu was strangling her. Oh, she also woke up. Wait, everyone's waking up. Oh yeah, they were beaten in their dream. She's still in, the, in his dream, I think. I think it's stuck. Oh, oh, okay. Maybe not. You have glasses. Oh. What about the other guy?
Oh, wow. Carnations. Damn. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Small. <laughs> oh God. Okay, there he is. No, it's it's still night. It's not morning. Well, then he would have woken up. Like, you know? You're gonna... Oh, great. But he woke up. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Upper rank demon. Okay.
Wow. Oh my god, another again hypnosis. This guy's just like a debuffer, like he, he he puts people to sleep and that's Ha! Cut off his hand. Or like you know. Um you've used used your trick too many times. It won't work now. It won't work. He's getting used to it. Cut off the hand, cut off the hand. Like, I think that's going to stop this whole nonsense. Wow, the animation. <laughs> Yeah, he's sleeping and then waking up. Oh, he's... Yeah, wow! Damn! Okay. Yeah, cut off the hand, cut off the hand. Oh, he's showing him a bad dream now. Oh, God. Yeah, he's showing him a bad dream. Oh, God. Yeah, come on. Okay. Whoa. Okay, that was a bit too easy, I think. Oh no, I think something else is going to happen now. Yeah, like something's wrong. I don't think so, like... Okay, what's happening here? <laughs> yeah, you as well. So how do you kill like someone like this? Yeah, please enlighten us. Yeah. What? Oh. Okay, now you have to destroy the train. Oh no. 
Yeah, technically they're inside him. That means they're inside his stomach or something. Okay, great. Now what? Yeah, wake the others up. Like, I think that's the only way. Okay, there you go. <laughs> okay, thank God. Like, at least someone is awake. He's still in the dream. <laughs> or not, okay. Okay, wake up the other two as well. His dream came true. <laughs> yeah, he wants to fight the train now. He can fight the train. Oh lord. <laughs> wow. Fall on your knee. <laughs> hmm. Yeah. Oh. Okay, well. This is disgusting. The whole, like, you know? Yeah. <laughs> wow. In a way, this guy is quite weak, you know, because he, he's just using tricks to like, mess with them. It's not that he's strong or something. It's just like a trickster. Oh, oh yeah, Inesco is growing up because of the... Oh, wow. Okay, this is... Yeah, this is prob... Oh no! Oh god! Come on! Oh, okay, Zensu! Whoa! <laughs> Oh yeah, he's sleeping. He's strong now. <laughs> yeah. Woof. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Oh no. <laughs> yeah.
No, it's sleep, but that's that's better in my opinion. Yeah, why is Rengoku not waking up? Like Yeah, like there are passengers here and there. Okay, there you go. Yeah, yeah, he's awake. Thank God. Oh. <laughs> Burn them down. <laughs> there you go. His power is going to come in handy. Because like it's not it's it's like fire. Oh damn. No. Oh <laughs> Okay. Eight cars. Five. Okay. Oh, okay, go and fight the. All right. Yeah, yeah. Ha! <laughs> Damn. Well, that's a Hashira for you. Yeah. Five cars by himself. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Master sweet spot. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Whoa! Damn! Oh, what is this guy doing? He's still awake! Yeah, he's awake! What the hell? Yeah! The engine or something? Oh! Oh, come on! Flash it! <laughs> oh, God! Oh! Oh, no, no, no! Okay, there you go! <laughs> wow! Okay, got him, didn't he? <laughs> yeah. Oh, beneath. What the? It's a bone! Oh my god! Uh. 
Fuck. What's this guy even doing? Like, he was not noticing what's happening behind him? Hmm. Okay. <laughs> ah. Okay. Timing is important here. Oh. Oh, stab it! Stab it in the eye! Oh my god, there's multiple eyes. Oh no, he's again going to go to sleep. Okay, there you go. Did Inosuke do it? Oh no. Yeah. Okay, okay, close. Close it. Oh no. With eyes shut. Wow. Close. No, no, you're, you're doing it in real life. What the hell? Yeah, yeah. Oh, God. Yeah, he was doing it. That was the plan. Yeah. Oh, my God. Good, yes. What the oh my god, this is another one of those guys. Oh god. What is this? Oh, this is uh, the thing. Yeah. Oh God. Wow. Wow, <laughs> look at that. Oh, close. <laughs> okay. Now Tanjiro. Oh my god, the flame! Oh! Wow! Damn! Okay, there you go! We got him, we got him! Oh no! Okay, Rengoku is there. Damn! Uh, 
Iya. Oh. Oh no. What happened to them? I'm sure you know is fine, but what about that guy? Come on. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I didn't even catch a cold. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> okay, you can do that. <laughs> well, let him do his thing, like, you know, if he wants to. <laughs> I hope the demon is dead, like, dead, dead, you know? Oh, great. What is this? Oh, no. Oh, no, no. I, he might go and try to attack Tanjiro now. Oh no, he is going to attack. Oh. Yeah. Oh god. Yeah, now he's going to go for him. Okay, he is, is disintegrating. Okay. Oh, wow. These are like the...
okay he really is dead that means okay i think so Hmm. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> okay. Damn. Wow. Like, he can do first aid within himself now. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> All right. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, and this whole problem is solved now, I think. I don't know, I feel somehow this thing is going to come back somehow, this demon. Like, there's still 30 minutes left. Oh, great. Yeah, like. Ah. Oh. Speak of the devil. What the? Who is this? It's a new demon. Upper to. Oh! Oh, no! Yeah, what? Was he a bait? The other demon? Just... Oh no, this is bad. Oh, good. Damn, his hand got... Yeah. Yeah. Well, because he has uh... <laughs> Yeah. Go home, you're drunk. Akaza. Because he has friends, let me guess. Oh, because you're human, okay. <laughs> well, okay. Yeah, you can do something in the... Yeah. Wow. Good.
Wow. Oh no. Compass needle. What? Okay, this is bad. Yeah, this guy's strong, unlike the other. Like that guy, the dad demon was using tricks, and this is like pure strength. <clears throat> oh, wow. Damn. Whoa. Wow, okay. But, you know... <laughs> you have some messed up values, my dude. Oh god. He's using the air pressure. Whoa! <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this guy's a problem. Yeah, get in close or yeah. Okay. <sighs> Whoa. Like they can't even help. Like they'll yeah, they'll be in the way if they go and try to help him. Oh my god. Whoa! Another thing that demons have a big advantage is they can purely focus on offense because they can regenerate. They only need to defend their neck, that's it. But Rengoku needs to defend and attack, like, that's one of the biggest advantage, <laughs> Google eyes. <laughs> one of the biggest advantages of the demons. No, that, that's a bad idea. Wow, this guy is full of himself. Oh god. Oh no. Yeah. Yeah, if you try to go in you'll get in her his way. Oh, boy.
This guy's persistent. He's still trying to convince him to become a demon. Whoa! Oh my god! Oh no, he defended. <coughs> oh! 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 No, no, not again. Damn! Okay! Oh no, he has the other hand! Uh, what? No, no! I don't think so! Wait, what happened? Oh, great. What happened? What? He got hurt us? Is he tired? What happened to him? Like... Wait... Yeah, he's not. Yeah, like water and fire, like it kind of like... Oh! Okay, damn. It's, it's a scotteric arc. Whoa! Oh, damn. Oh, damn. 
Wow. Oh. Okay. Come on, get his get his head. Oh no. Head the head. Wow, the animation. This is amazing. Okay, okay. Oh, not vertically, horizontally. Okay, did he? Oh no. Oh god. Oh no. Oh damn, the thing that his dad never said to him. Oh my god. He had to hear it from a demon. Demon said that thing to him. Yeah. What a like simple statement, but a lot of people do not understand this statement. Like the yeah. Okay. Oh. Okay. Yeah, it's, 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 it's getting... Yeah, 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 hold him, hold him! Oh, he was... Yeah, he can... Oh my god! Okay, Tanjiro, come on, like... Yeah, like, now is the chance! Yeah, 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 exactly! Okay. Damn. Okay. Come on, you know Yeah, yeah. Oh no! 
Oh God! Come on! Somehow! He... He's going to run now. Oh, the, the sword is still lodged in his neck. Stop him! Someone stop him! Oh no, he got it! Oh, great! Oh! Oh! Oh no, he's still running! This will be your downfall. This get this will be the downfall. That's the same thing. Wow, this demon he changed his tune so quickly. I'm going to talk about this later on. What I was going to talk about, Tanjiro said everything. Like... The crow. Oh no.
Oh no. Ok. Oh god. Damn, the crow.
Oh no, that's not the same girl. Who is this lady? I thought that was the same girl. I'm going to join them, yeah. Damn. Okay, well... <clears throat> oh my god, like this was... I was not expecting like the ending, like after he defeated that, the lesser demon like suddenly one of the upper ranks coming that was i was not expecting that i was thinking maybe the the demon that they defeated he was probably going to like somehow regenerate or something i was thinking something like that because there were 30 minutes left but suddenly like like one thing that like you know um Zenitsu said that why did the an upper rank demon come Maybe, I, I think maybe, like, they use the lower ranked demon as a bait. So that, like, the demon can tire everyone out. And then the upper ranked demon will come and, like, you know, kind of. Oh, maybe not. Like, the upper ranked demon was pretty strong. So I doubt it needed something like that. What was the name? Asaka or something like that, wasn't it? Oh, wait, what? Oh no, something's wrong with the video. Okay, I'm not going to like <laughs> sync the, uh, what do you call it? Timer anymore because like it was buffering. Because like, you know, um... <coughs> like it's almost at the end. So I'm, I'm not going to sync it anymore. Like I'll keep it like this. So yeah, what was I saying? Like yeah, I was I was saying like maybe the upper ranked demon. Like I was thinking maybe the upper upper ranked demon needed. Like you know did something like that because it wanted to tire everyone out. But I doubt it needed something like that because Asaka. I think that his name was Asaka was pretty strong himself. And pretty prideful. I doubt he would have even let the like something like that happen because of his pride. The sword. What happened to the katana that Rengoku had? The like the demon kind of threw it away. So 
like i'm sure like they're going to retrieve it later on like you know that uh the demon cops like you know the others would come and somehow retrieve it is that the end yeah that's the end oh my god what an ep what a movie yeah this is definitely like what can i say one of the top movies that i've seen like not only the animation but the the story was something and like i would have loved loved to see more of rengoku but you know like this is just it I, i'm guessing like yeah this is depressing all right so this movie like it was amazing and like we, we kind of like see two parts the first part is the um the lesser demon i can't remember his name uh, he was like you know kind of uh, using trips uh, like tricks to kind of defeat them which unfortunately did not work and it was quite easy to defeat him I, i'm going to say like it was easy to defeat him because he was not much of a threat like you know like his like he was tricky like he was playing dirty but that was just it like other than that like like he had nothing uh like 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 this kind of shows us what is like the difference in the skills of an upper ranked demon and lower ranked demon. like it's like heaven and hell difference like in my opinion if rengoku was um like awake from the first like you know from the beginning he could have defeated this like lower ranked demon in just two or three slashes that would have been it but <clears throat> this demon kind of uh like you know kind of like played some tricks on them and like kind of played dirty as i said but in a way like you know like they're demons like they are supposed to play dirty so what else do you even expect but like you know like as he was like making them sleep and i think he was a little bit overconfident as like as he said like he wanted them to see some good dreams then was going to show them some bad dreams and like stuff like that and kind of stalling the time that was and was not expecting tanjiro to suddenly break out of the spell and like i did not have much concern for him because i knew that like he was going to get defeated he was pretty weak you know in a way but then when the next demon came in the upper rank demon i think his name was asaka or something um but yeah when he came in like that's when like i started having concerns but i still thought like maybe like you know like probably rengoku was going to defeat him somehow Ugh, but it it was not like you know like it it did not go as i thought it would and like the like you know what's more unfortunate is like the demon that he tried to defeat with his life he ran away like you know like now he's probably going to regenerate and everything and he'll be good as new and it it would have been like you know like like rengu sacrifice like like it won't mean nothing but because like you know tanjiro kind of uh, what can i say like i don't know but yeah now now i'm i'm sure like tanjiro is going to have some kind of uh an uh what can i say like a vendetta against this uh the upper demon asaka or who knows maybe not because tanjiro is a little bit of a different of a character like like he does not like one thing i've that i've noticed about tanjiro is like he does not let emotions you know like uh, he does not let emotions um uh, rule him you know he like i don't know like who knows like something might change because of this like you know this incident but let's just see and okay now the rengoku's past 
we got a little bit of information about his dad his mom his younger brother and his dad i don't know something might have happened like you know like maybe after his wife's death he somehow changed or something like as like rengu said like my dad was not like this so something might have triggered the change in him uh we're still not sure but i suppose we're going to get to see like you know we're probably going to get more information in the upcoming season or like you know in the yeah upcoming season and like that was his dad like and his mom uh his mom was a what can i say like this, the things that his mom said were so simple yet so true in a way because like as she said that like if you were strong if you're born with talent you're supposed to help people with it not like you know do bad stuff with it and like like you know it's it's, it's a very simple like statement like i'm sure like everybody knows this but somehow people forget this thing you know like it's a simple statement so it's so easy to forget as well like you know like that's how people kind of go towards the dark side as like somehow people might misuse their powers misuse their talents not only in anime in real life as well like obviously in real life it's a little bit different because it's not that they have superpowers but like talent is everywhere you know in the real life in anime every, everywhere so like as his mom said that you know if you're born with talent you help people with it you do not use it for your own selfish gains and that's something that is so simple yet so difficult to remember people kind of forgot forget about it as they like as they get drunk on that power as time goes on but people who remember that you know like they kind of grow up to be people like rengoku tanjiro you know and yeah and uh, like you know like and the teachings in the childhood also helps like how his mom taught him something like this taught him the you know the good morals and everything they also help and anyways that's that was something about his mom and his brother his brother um, like as he said like i also want to become a hashira but like his brother is doing probably going to like doing this because to get some recognition from his dad for his dad to accept him or something but as rengoku said that you're not like me i like you know like you have me as a big brother so if no one like you know if no one ex- like, like you know like kind of accepts you or praises you i'll praise you i'll accept you so you don't have to worry you keep doing what you want to do and yeah and his dad as i said like his dad must something must have happened the like you know something to trigger the change as his dad kind of like you know like his dad seemed a lot pessimistic as he said like what like what good will it even do like even if i like you know you become a hashira hashira like nothing's going to help and stuff like that i'm sure like his dad must have like you know seen so many comrades dying and all like just like how uh, the master of the hashiras like you know he like in the beginning scene we see him kind of saying that so many people died you know like i'm sure like his dad must have also faced something like that which kind of made him um like give up you know who knows i don't know i'm just like kind of guessing everything but yeah also another thing like in the beginning when the show started um the the lady with the uh, the master of the hashiras uh I thought that that lady was uh, those two little kids you know who we saw in season 1 those two like, you know like who look like twins or yellow uh, like uh, white haired I thought it was is the same like you know kid I thought they kind of grow grew up or something but then by the like in the ending scene we see her with one of that ki- one of those kids so uh, maybe that girl is their sister or their mom either of it I I don't know and like i don't know what the relationship is the master and that lady but 
you know like they're, they're different people like i thought like the lady was those two one of those two kids but apparently not so okay i'm sure we'll get more answers in the you know upcoming seasons and the begin like the, the first portion of the uh, movie was uh, like you know them kind of trying to get out of their dreams it was kind of funny to see how their dreams differed you know like how zensu was thinking that you know like he was with nezuka and everything and how uh, <laughs> you know ske was thinking like you know like i'm the boss like uh, like you know he was kind of like ordering tanjiro zensu and nezuko and like uh, like uh, Tanjiro's dream was pretty, like, you know, uh, what can I say, like, bittersweet, in a way. As, like, you know, like, she kind of, he got, kind of got to meet his mom and dad, uh, mom and his brothers and sisters again, but, you know, it was sad to think that it was just a dream. That and, like, you know, um, uh, Rengoku, Rengoku's uh, dream was also something a bit... Not sad, as I said, like melancholic or bittersweet in a way. Like, yeah. And uh, I kind of forgot about it, but like, you know, Nezuko was there. So like in, in the later portion of the reaction, I kind of said that like, oh, like Nezuko is here. Like what happened to her? Is she also dreaming? And then I thought maybe not. And then like we see like Nezuko coming out and helping Tanjiro break out of the spell. And their biggest mistake, I think, was like not like, uh, like, you know, like Nezuko was the biggest what can i say like the thing that kind of helped tanjiro break out of the whole spell so when the like the lesser demon was kind of like lamenting and saying that how the hell did he even get out <laughs> it was because of his own carelessness you know so like like he messed up he did not think about someone else also being there apart from tanjiro and the others and uh, yeah and then like the whole battle happens the whole like he kind of takes control of the train and all and like tanjiro defeats not tanjiro but like you know like yeah tanjiro like they kind of defeat him and like, you know zenitsu again like he, he, because he was sleeping he was so damn like you know op and all and rengoku kind of like wiped the whole like five like you know the five train cars kind of wiped it to himself you know he also helped and you know and like good teamwork everything was so go, going so well but then comes in this upper ranked um, demon uh, asaka his name was i think and the like you know the one of the most dangerous battle starts as they fight now about asaka you know in the beginning i was thinking oh maybe this guy is not as like you know ruthless not ruthless but as cruel bad as the other demons like the other demons we kind of see them uh, like you know like they kind of like doing stuff for their own like you know selfish desires and stuff and like you know for something like that and but this guy like i was thinking like he was kind of saying like consistently trying to um convince rengoku to become one of the uh, demons so that you know like even though it was kind of a selfish desire because he wanted to fight him but still like he was consistent and like persistent in it and i was thinking like maybe he this guy is a little bit different you know and then comes the most shocking part i'm saying here shocking is because how he changed his tune so quickly and then i thought that oh my god like no this guy is the same as the others he's also one of those demons like you know like i was surprised at how like quickly he changed his tune when he's like started to understand that he's going to die like you know like in one of the scenes, we see him kind of saying that Rengoku, don't die, Rengoku. Like, you know, like, be become a demon, Rengoku. And then when he understands that he's going to die, like, you know, he himself is going to die because his hand is being captured. His, like, you know, the, his throat is being almost, like, sliced off. He, what, he's, what does he say then? He says that, oh, like, I need to kill him quickly. Otherwise, I'll die. Like, what? Like in the previous scene, you were saying like, "Don't die, Rengoku." So like, like the fear of death, like how it changes people. Like I was kind of thinking like this demon might be a little bit of an honorable demon, you know? Like he might be bad, he might be a demon, he might be uh, like you know having selfish desires and stuff. But maybe he's honorable. I was thinking, 
oh boy no like no he was not honorable at all like as soon as he saw that like he was going to die he completely changed his tune and said that oh like i need to kill him quickly and then when he finds that he really is going to die that like you know the uh, sun is coming up and everything and like tanjiro inosuke is are behind him like he decides to run away wow like <laughs> i was not surprised because like you know like demons are supposed to be bad and evil like that i know but i thought maybe he was honorable and by honorable i mean like you know kind of not like resorting into tricks and stuff and like you know kind of keeping what you say consistent like he was saying that rengoku don't die i want you to become a demon and then as soon as the tables turned he kind of changed it that's not honorable in my opinion at least and like and then as tanjiro said like everything that i wanted to say tanjiro kind of said everything like you know like like you are a coward you're running away and you are like kind of like you were like saying stuff to rengoku like you don't have any right to do that because you are the one who is like uh, showing your back towards us and running away like a damn coward rengoku here is has saved the whole like you know passengers in the train he saved us he is still like you know like he is a lot more what can i say like uh, like you know honorable better in every aspect than you you don't have the right to even like like you know you don't have the right to kind of like comment on rengoku yeah and like like yeah that's that's what i was trying to say at that moment like like how he changed his tune and how he started running away like a like a rat <sighs> ah god like i i feel bad for even thinking like that that guy was like that demon was even a little bit of honorable you know had a little bit of honor which is like quite rare in demons i was thinking like maybe i was probably going to like this demon in some way oh no i won't like like the thing that he did in the end that kind of like opened my eyes <sighs> but you know yeah like <sighs> that was a movie i have to say and uh, and in the end like we see like you know where what's his name uh, rengo who kind of passing on everything to tanjiro and kind of saying that like go to my house you might find something there and then we see uh, all the other like you know the hashiras and all the other people's reaction to knowing that rengu is no more and yeah another hash like you know another person died one of the hachira uh, what do you call it like seat is empty and yeah <sighs> okay like my impressions amazing this was really great uh, not only the animation but the story um the like what else like the fighting scenes uh the message that it had Like everything was so like amazing i have to like admit and rengoku was something like like only 2 hours of a movie and this movie was able to kind of like you know kind of what can i say like 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 so, so little of a screen time he got like 2 hours only but that was enough for him like he established himself in this in this anime like you know like there are some characters in like in different animes who establish themselves for example like i'm taking an example for example in naruto the characters who established themselves were jiraiya itachi you know like these were the characters who established themselves and they got so many episodes for them but rengoku in just 2 hours of a span 
even though we know nothing about him like you know like little bits on pieces of the backstory we got and everything he was able to establish himself as one of the characters in this story and i doubt anyone will forget him because of the presence that he had of the presence that he had in tanjiro's life as well and in this movie and i'm happy that you for table animated this that was an amazing like you know like story arc and like you know it, it did justice to i'm guessing the manga uh, yeah this is the uh, demon uh, slayer has a manga isn't it the manga is the source material i think yeah so and you know um also like the song obviously like lisa i think it was lisa wasn't it who sang the ending song and like you know lisa sang the song like lisa your for table like you know the best of the best and yeah i am really looking forward to the upcoming season and i'll definitely react to it and like you know like this this movie deserves every bit of praise that it's getting i'm like you know i'm i'm really glad that like you know like you know demon slayer get such got such an amazing movie and i'm so happy and yeah so thank you guys for watching uh, i'm sure everyone loved this uh, movie you know like i doubt anyone did not like it movie like you know like i doubt it like <laughs> but yeah so yeah guys thank you guys for watching this was demon slayer uh, mugen reshahen uh, i think yeah and let me just check yeah mugen reshahen so if you guys enjoyed my reaction be sure to press the like button and also be sure to subscribe because that will really help me a lot and comment down below anything you want to say or your opinions about this movie and i'll check them all out so yeah guys um i'll okay i'll i'm going to like okay next week as like in, in this day i usually do like every week a movie so in next week i'm going to do uh, a fate movie uh, this is one thing that i've not watched fate uh, Khaled Liner Prismailia movie um, Oath Under the Snow I think and I've heard that this is amazing and I, I I've you know I've I, I've seen Prismailia uh, the anime but I kind of forgot about it so I'm kind of rewatching it and by the next by next week I'll probably finish uh, all the animes kind of rewatching the anime again so like you know like I'll be ready to react to the movie so next week I'm doing Fade uh, Khaled Liner Prismailia uh, movie Oath Under the Snow. So yeah, uh, tune in if you guys are interested as well. So thank you guys for watching again. I'll see you guys next week with another movie reaction. So uh, until then, goodbye and have a nice day.